So hello, uh, welcome to my uh, first tutorial about the my sci-fi gun. In this tutorial, chapter one, I will uh, show you in a speed up video how to bake with the high poly onto the low poly uh, version with the material ID uh, multi sub object. So the first thing I'm doing right now is I'm creating a multi sub object with uh, like 10 different uh, IDs and I'm starting to apply um, the different IDs uh, for each uh, part of my uh, object my high poly object so I will do that as you can see so the goal there is to divide every um, part of your uh, high poly model that you want to bake uh, into different material IDs so when you will bake the cage won't uh, like intersect and fuck your uh, your baking process So the next uh, part of this tutorial is uh, to apply the same material ID that you applied already on the high poly, but now it's time to do it on the low poly. So if you applied like uh, material ID one for a specific part of your uh, of, of your object in, in your high poly, then for that same part in the low poly, you need to apply the same material ID so one. So you do that. Basically, you need to match the colors. That's that's the goal. And uh, 
that, that's pretty much it. So uh, you'll see my process. I'm just trying to match the same IDs on, from my high poly to my low poly. So when I will bake again, my cage will not intersect between uh, each other and uh, it will give a proper bake for the for uh, in the first time in the first uh, try that you will do if you would not do that uh, you could still divide your object detach each part and bake each part uh, separately but it's a longer process in my opinion so that's it so um, the next part is uh, as you uh, probably figured it's time to bake so you just uh, simply move your high poly at the same exact position as your uh, low poly um, you well depending on uh, the render you choose so scan line uh, mentor ray you just apply your settings choose your map size and etc and the only difference uh, is to go in the settings so in the render uh, render to texture tab you go in the settings and you click uh, like I will show in the zoom in uh, you click on uh, bake with material ID or uh, something like that I cannot even remember what what the name is but there's like a setting uh, telling you uh, uh, bake using material IDs so um, you check that and again when you will bake the, the each piece uh, a different color will not intersect with like uh, another color it will just work with that same exact color so blue will bake with blue yellow will, ba will bake with yellow and it won't like even if the cage is bigger it won't intersect, intersect between uh, each other so that's pretty much it so you can see the final result of my in a first try uh, by the way uh, I did not tweak uh, the AO in Photoshop or nor the normal map in Photoshop is my first try, first uh, bake, and it gives uh, that result that you can see at the end of the video in uh, in Marmoset. So in the next chapter, I will uh, texture the gun. Uh, I'll show you my process of texturing, and I will of course try the new Didu uh, beta that just uh, been released uh, last week. So I will try to implement that new workflow in my uh, in my process. Thank you for watching.